science is for everyone. It's the idea that learning's for everyone, that success is for everyone. And if you start with that vision, you can then begin to break down the obstacles and build new pathways. I grew up in East New York, Brooklyn. I sort of had this very early introduction to the disparate opportunity that exists in New York. And teachers and people who work with kids could have a tremendous impact on the people around them. The partnership between the Hall of Science and the Department of Education to build this early childhood system really speaks to what you can do when you bring all the assets of a community together. We know that children who have great early learning experiences in places like the Mosaic Center, they're more likely to graduate from high school, more likely to succeed in the workforce in the long term. When Rich was the deputy mayor for policy and strategy in New York City, he pulled off a remarkable feat so that every single four-year-old in New York had access to a high-quality preschool education. This school in particular has a partnership with the New York Hall of Science. Our teachers have training directly from the Hall of Science to really engage in how to best serve our students. They can build their critical thinking skills using the practices from Design Make Play. So we really get to be that first step to introduce them to STEM education at such an early age. Our families have free memberships to the Hall of Science. Not only are we building a relationship between the school and the families, but also the families and the New York Hall of Science, an institution that is a staple in this community. Rich Bury has spent his whole life dedicated to public service with a focus on creating educational opportunities for young people. He created a model for what this kind of work can look like collaborating with community-based anchor institutions in ways that advance opportunity for children in neighborhoods and communities across New York City. One of the innovative things about this particular partnership is we are incorporating our design make play approach to the already existing STEM that happens at the school. Using scientific tools for children in the classroom, they're wearing little lab coats, they're coming to the museum and doing all sorts of investigations. And the idea is when they become enamored and feel less intimidated by STEM at three and four years old, chances are that that positive experience can bloom into a possible STEM career. Robin Hood, our mission is to fight poverty in New York City. We invest in the highest impact programs and organizations that are in the business of helping New Yorkers achieve equal opportunity. It's very important that kids have great schools and have access to all the technical skills they need to succeed. But you've also got to do the work of making sure that kids want to learn all the skills they need to succeed. And at the Hall of Science, they help spark that love of learning that hopefully they can take with them into their careers. It is one of the most important institutions in New York. And I really do think it's a model for every institution in the city that has a public mission to think about how can you think differently about bringing the work you do to the people in the communities who need access to it. When I went to visit the Mosaic Center, this little girl looked up at me and she yelled, I'm a scientist. I love the Hall of Science. <laughs>